Peace Deep Minds 255 here. If you saw this trail already, yo, you know what this was hype. It's been so long since I watched the Capcom trail and have been this excited. I mean, really. And for what I learned from the event hubs, which I'll be reading to you later, this character is actually the future, a glimpse to the future Street Fighter. If Street Fighter 6 is gonna look like this, Capcom is looking with with uh, looking to reclaim their drum their throne. I mean the animation on this character is by far the best I've seen in Street Fighter 5, period. The character is pretty animated. Even though it was made to look real, he looks like he's straight out of the anime or something. And I guess Capcom's picking up on the fact that that's popular right now. They just saw what happened with Dragon Ball Fighters, and as you can hear, D-Mine is not normally this excited, but did looking at this Luke, uh, Travers character, I'm not even sure about his name, looking at this kickball, I don't even know where I got Travers from, but looking at this Luke character, I am hyped and ready to get back in Street Fighter V, because I saw Oro, and I was like, that is not enough to get me back in there, and long time Capcom fan, but if Street Fighter 6 is going to look anything or play anything like what we're seeing right now with uh, Luke here. We are in for a treat and maybe Capcom has been storing up all this time to come back. Um, and, and definitely I have a trailer breakdown coming to you. But uh, this is more like a reaction video. 255 doesn't even react normally, but this had me... Hyped. Okay, so from Event Hubs, we learned the following about Luke. Street Fighter V has been developed to pay homage to the past, but Luke will give us a glimpse into the future, said director Nakayama. Forgive me for mispronouncing the brother's name. When prepping to reveal the trailer, he will be expanding the world of Street Fighter. And um, I don't know if that's just animation wise. I don't know if that's just um, great martial art action anime. I don't know if they have a whole new cast of characters. But if if this is classic Capcom, this is what we've been missing for all these um, years, right? This is what Arc System, Bandai Namco. Um, and other fighting game companies have been uh, leading away, you know, because Street Fighter has been missing in this form. But this is the innovation, this is the creativity that we expect from Capcom, right? Anyway, uh, Event Hub continues. We feel strongly that Luke will be a great addition to the game, I agree, and that he has a bright future in the world of Street Fighter. I agree again, stated producer Shusei Matsumoto. Luke appears to be a mixed martial arts kind of fighter who may specialize in kickboxing as his main style. Most of the attacks used in his trailer are punches, but he does showcase a rolling kick that looks like it might be an overhead. Though, Cap though Capcom did not address any of Luke's V system abilities, he does perform a bit of a charge up that appears to upgrade some of his attacks when successfully completed. His next punch after the charge up causes Ryu to bounce off the wall for a longer combo. He clearly activates one of his triggers at one point and appears to gain the ability to send projectile-like sparks from his punches that cross the entire length of the screen. So that's from the event hubs. Um, but man, this is exciting. I'm looking forward to this. I'm gonna watch the summer breakdown, see what news they got for us there. But uh, this is a way this is what you need to get people back into Street Fighter V um, and to look forward to Street Fighter VI. This is how you close the game out. You want more characters like this because, to be honest, Akira is cool, Oro was cool, but that that was not enough, right? You've been not great to the fans over the last decade or so when it came to games. You needed to come back strong, Capcom, and in this video, this is what I'm seeing. I'm seeing you come back strong, and I'm looking forward to uh, playing this character, and I'm looking forward to the rest of Street Fighter V now, and 
Hopefully season six. Yo, this is Deep Mind 255 out one. But yo, Deep Minds, let me know. Uh, what are your thoughts about you, kid? Uh, are you excited for Street Fighter Five more, or have you always just stood on? I've been playing the game forever. Um, Varlog Ming, so this type of character uh, fits with me as well. I hope the character is not this flashy, and then he's like low tired. That would be that would be beyond unacceptable. But this character again shows that Capcom can still bring the creativity that we saw in the '90s. In early 2000, right? This is the Street Fighter Alpha 3, Marvel vs. Capcom 2, Third Strike, Rival Schools, Dark Stalkers, Capcom that we love. And when Capcom's doing it right, I'm one of the biggest fans. Again, DeepMind255 out. Looking forward to your comments.